Tajisan's superficial punctate keratopathy, TSPK, also Tajisan's superficial punctate keratitis, is a disease of the eyes. The causes of TSPK are not currently known, but details of the disease were first published in the Journal of the American Medical Association in 1950 by the renowned American ophthalmologist, Phillips Tajisan, 1903-2002, after whom it is named. Symptoms A patient with TSPK may complain of blurred vision, dry eyes, a sensation of having a foreign body stuck in the eye, photophobia, sensitivity to bright light, burning sensations, and watery eyes. On inspection with a slit lamp, tiny lumps can be found on the cornea of the eye. These lumps can be more easily seen after applying fluorescein or rose bengal dye eye drops. The lumps appear to be randomly positioned on the cornea and they may appear and disappear over a period of time, with or without treatment. TSPK may affect one or both eyes. When both eyes are affected, the tiny lumps found on the cornea may differ in number between eyes. The severity of the symptoms often vary during the course of the disease. The disease may appear to go into remission, only to later reappear after months or years. Causes The causes of TSPK are currently not yet well known. However, there seem to be indications that dysfunctioning of the mibumian gland can cause the condition. Inflammation of the mibumian glands, also known as mibumitis, mibumian gland dysfunction, or posterior blepharitis, causes the glands to be obstructed by thick waxy secretions. Besides leading to dry eyes, the obstructions can be degraded by bacterial lipases, resulting in the formation of free fatty acids, which irritate the eyes and sometimes cause punctate keratopathy. Treatment There are a number of different treatments to deal with TSPK. Symptoms may disappear if untreated, but treatment may decrease both the healing time and the chances of remission. PRK laser eye surgery may cure this disease. Note. A full clinical study has not been done, but a case study of one person was reported in 2002 PRKPTK as a treatment. Artificial tear eye drops or ointments may be a suitable treatment for mild cases. Low dosage steroidal eye drops, such as prednisone, fluoromethalone, letoprednol, letmax 0.5%, or rimexolone. Steroidal drops should be used with caution and the eye pressure should be regularly checked during treatment. Soft contact lenses. Cyclosporin is an experimental treatment for TSPK. It is usually used during transplants as it reduces the immune system response. Tacrolimus, protopic 0.03% ointment, is also an experimental treatment. Laser eye treatment. Amniotic membrane, case study. Please subscribe and thanks for watching.